Astăzi se împlinesc 20 de ani de când apelul României s-a ridicat la cartierul general al NATO. Un moment istoric pentru țara noastră, 2 aprilie 2004 a devenit un reper în calendarul marilor evenimente care au marcat evoluția democratică a României. Antena 3 CNN marchează acest eveniment esențial din săptămâna NATO, care a debutat cu ziua de 29 martie, când am ratificat instrumentele de aderare la Washington, 2 aprilie ziua ridicării drapelului la Bruxelles și 4 aprilie ziua în care acum 75 de ani a luat naștere de Alianța Nord-Atlantică prin tratatul de la Washington. Cu acest prilej special, excelența sa, Kathleen Kevelec, ambasadorul Statelor Unite la București, a transmis în exclusivitate pentru Antena 3 CNN un mesaj pe care îl urmărim și noi chiar acum. Romania's entry into NATO in 2004 represents a pivotal juncture cementing its dedication to democracy, security and stability within the Euro-Atlantic region. As U.S. cultural attaché serving in Romania in its early accession years, and now back as U.S. ambassador to Romania, I'm proud to have witnessed the remarkable evolution Romania has undergone in the past 20 years. Since joining NATO, Romania has contributed to collective defense by actively participating in NATO missions in Afghanistan and Kosovo, and in NATO exercises hosted in Romania or in other NATO countries. This has bolstered NATO's deterrence and defense in the Black Sea region. Romania's commitment to modernizing its armed forces and its adherence to NATO's spending targets further highlight its unwavering commitment to the alliance's shared security. In addition to these important contributions, Romania has been instrumental in fostering NATO partnerships with neighboring countries including the Republic of Moldova. During these two decades, a new generation of Romanians was born in NATO. They have benefited from political and economic freedom, rule of law, respect for human rights, and opportunities to study abroad. Recently, Foreign Minister Odobescu and I met with high school students in Bucharest as part of the Born in NATO campaign initiated by Romania's Foreign Ministry. I was impressed by their interest in NATO security guarantees, as well as in learning about the risks that Romania would face and the opportunities it would miss without NATO and EU membership. We also talked about the strategies to use to prevent falling victim to disinformation and fake news. Looking to the future, I'm confident that Romania will remain a leading ally within NATO, contributing to the alliance's efforts to tackle emerging security challenges and uphold our collective values. The United States remains steadfast in its commitment to strengthening our partnership with Romania, collaborating to secure a safer and more stable future for all members of NATO. We are definitely stronger together. La mulțan Romania in NATO.